your throne with all the praise all the worship all the thanksgiving the gratitude lord we owe it and give it only to you you alone who is such a great covenant keeper lover friend deliverer healer father my god lord we bless your name this day we thank you for waking us up for allowing us to be alive today some of us it's morning afternoon evening Whatever time it is, Lord, it is because of your grace and your mercy that all of us are alive. So we bless your name, faithful one. We adore you. We exalt you and we lift you high. We honor you and we magnify your name. We surrender ourselves before your presence and approach your throne, God, with all the praise, all the thanksgiving, all the honor and the glory only due to you and you alone. Father, may your name be praised. May your name be magnified. May your name be lifted. And may your name be adored. Look at even now how somebody can stop in their car so that I may be able to pass when they were I was really close. I could have gone and they were far, but they waited. So, Father, even in moments like this, I see your mercy, your goodness, and your grace. So we thank you for this day. We surrender everything before your presence. Mind, body, soul, and spirit, Lord. We give ourselves away to you and you alone, Lord Jesus Christ. Jehovah Nisi, we thank you for protecting and preserving our children this night, Lord. For covering them in the precious blood of Jesus Christ. For keeping them alive, Lord. It is only you who giveth life. It is only you, Father my God, who is the creator of air, Father. It is only you who knows how to make these bodies, Father my God, exuse and be able to carry this so-called life that is within us. So we bless you, Lord, for our families, for our loved ones, for the battles that you won this evening, Lord. For us to be here is not a coincidence, neither is it luck, but by the preservation and the mercy, the grace of God, where God, you fought for us this night, if we could actually see what happened in the night when we are sleeping, Jehovah Jireh, we would be dancing for you every day day 70 times do not even be enough because lord it is you who has kept the gates of heaven mighty strong tower that the enemy can never come up against that he will never defeat you and that he will never overcome you you protected us protected our children kept us alive jehovah jireh 
kept their safe one victory against the witches all the marine kingdoms and the people that practice voodoo in the night you kept us safe lord you watched over us you made sure that this day we wake up this morning you won victory father my god so lord we surrender our lives our families to you lord we surrender everything to you you who fight to protect our marriages many are the things that the enemy tries to do to come up against our home for our marriages is heaven on earth it is you, God, who establishes our family for us, not by coincidence or luck, but by your purpose, your mercy, your grace, your will, and how it has been destined. So, Father, we thank you. We surrender everything before you, and we ask that you help us to live a godly life, a life that is pleasing unto thee, Lord, a life that honors you, a life that fears you, a life that exalts and lifts you high, Lord, in spirit and in truth. Jehovah needs, just like we understand from Titus, Father, my God, chapter 1, Jehovah Nisi, chapter 2, Jehovah Jireh, from 1, Jehovah Nisi to 17, we get the word of God and we get to understand your faithfulness and your greatness. Father, this morning we ask in the name of Jesus, even in our environment, where we work, where we sleep, where we sit, where we work with different people, where we are with different people, different energies, different walks of life, different beliefs, ways and manners, we ask that you help us to keep the godly standard, Father, to keep your ways in us, to keep your righteousness your love your kindness in us that no matter what happens we shall not be moved lord that we shall not become spiteful we shall not become vengeful we shall not become wicked instead lord we shall remain godly until you come again especially in this present age lord in this present dark times where everything is in the end times where the devil is doing everything lord to want all of us to perish where there is evil and wickedness where daughters are fighting with their mothers and sons are killing their fathers father we ask that you help us to keep a godly standard we help we ask that you help us to abide by your word to be faithful and to remain vigilant and focus on you we ask also father my god that as we yield and lean only to you help us lord with our own transgressions iniquities and sins lord deliver us jehovah jireh we cover our own mother and father's homes we cover our in-laws extended family lord the people that you have given us through marriage lord we also ask that may the spirit of god God, be vigilant, faithful, and alive and awake in that place. That, Lord, you also set our loved ones free. That they will have an encounter with you, for we do not want them to miss your presence. We do not want them to miss your grace, Lord. We do not want them to miss your kingdom. Father, this day we surrender all of these things before you. Asking you, Lord, to help us in that moment when the situation is happening. Please be strong, mighty, and faithful in us, Lord. That we shall be able to overcome, Lord that we shall not allow the enemy to make us sin because of whatever is in front of us. Instead, help us to keep a godly standard. Even when we are treated evil, even with our enemies, Lord, as you are the one who has said we should love our enemies, as hard as it is, we are asking that, Lord, you help us to keep a godly standard, that we are not going to take vengeance into our own hands, that we are not going to fight. Instead, we shall remain focused, vigilant, faithful, and fearing, and knowing that, God, you are our vindicator wherever we are accused. You you vindicate us wherever they lie against us you will speak the truth for us and wherever the darkness tries to over again over us lord we also know that your light will shine for your light shines lord there is no darkness in you lord even in the dark you are still able to see for you are the light that shineth lord in the dark that darkness cannot comprehend lord we surrender each and everything to you as we are going out and coming in we cover our going out and coming in and we ask that lord you protect us and guide us go before us lord cover us lord protect us and keep us safe jehovah nisi we surrender everything to you mind body soul and spirit our marriages our homes our health our finances our loved ones everything lord we surrender every household that lord you will provide and sustain every home that nobody shall sleep hungry and that nobody shall be without we also ask lord that you help each and everyone especially those that have not received jesus christ that lord they'll be able to come to come to an encounter with you even those ones that think that they keep the when they received you they keep falling they feel like it's not worthy or they can't do it we ask lord that you keep on enduring in them lord preserving father my god seeking them and calling them because it is you who helps us because all of us are sinners before you lord only you god your spirit helps us for we have all fallen short of your glory 
your grace and your mercy. So, Father, my God, we ask that you, you bring all your children, all of us to you. For all of us seek you and your salvation, Lord. Jehovah Nisi, we thank you. We surrender all these prayers. We trust, believe, and we thank you, Lord, for answered prayers. We thank you for your presence. We thank you for hearing and answering us. We thank you for always being faithful and for always being the place, the room, the dominion where we could always go be ourselves and have the place where we are safe where we know that we shall be given the answers and everything that we need and not we want the things that will help us to live in this world father my god and overcome the enemy and triumph over him in jesus his mighty name we bless you we adore you and we exalt your name May the, the glory, the honor, and the praise be received before you, Father, this morning. May our prayers be as incense before your presence. Let it come with a sweet aroma. We are so grateful and thankful to you, Father, my God. Without you, we are nothing. So, God, we bless you. We thank you, and we lift your name high. It is in the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. We adore thee. We worship you in Jesus' name. Amen. 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 Brothers and sisters, let me carry the go. I'll see all of you. Have a blessed day. May God bless all of you. Love all of you. And God loves you more. Shalom. Shalom in the name of Jesus Christ. And let's continue to be vigilant, faithful, and remain fearing to God. It is true the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the living God. Let me carry the go. Bye-bye. Shalom.